Hello, welcome back to another video on Happy Christ Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, whatever the fuck you guys say. Um, welcome back to another video. My name's the Gaming Giant and I haven't uploaded in a while, but I am here now, so I'm gonna teach you guys how to install Oplifine. And why should you install Oplifine? For one, shaders. It has in the built in capability to run your shader packs. Second it just boosts FPS and makes the game run so much faster and so much cleaner. Just like in like alone, it makes the glass look hella better. And ooh, ooh, here let me show you. So this is just a basic shader pack. Really, just helps with like something like shadows. Just makes the game look a little bit nicer. Ooh, and makes like the leaves and stuff dance. Here, let me just fly to a quick tree and show you. Just look at that waving tree. <laughs> and it it doesn't really do here. At night, it makes sure everything looks bright so you can actually see it. It looks pretty nice. Usually the, my computer can run this about 45 frames at most. And it's like a basic shader pack for people who don't really want like the full aesthetic of shaders. But want like something nice like this. And of course the download link will be in the description. I'll show you it here in a minute. Now here's more of like a an extreme shader pack. As you can see, it gets real dark. So it's about nighttime right now. You can really see with like, you can just really with like all the stuff that gives off light really looking so look nice. And usually when there's light behind the portal with the sun going down, you can see the shadow of the portal. And here, let me show you what it looks like during the day. I have the command block set up. And yeah, it's really bright and really nice like you still see the waves and yeah what's this um oh subscribe and hit the bell i want to hit a thousand subs soon so hit that bell if you, if you find this helpful so now i'm going to show you guys how to install it real quick okay the first thing you really need to do is make sure your java is up to date so it's simple just click download java and it will lead you to the download page so this is the first thing that you really need to install first it's free don't worry i'm going to make sure we leave the download description in the description <laughs> the download link in the description and then amplified of course this is what you want if you want to show all versions you can like if you still play on 2b2t for 1.12.2 or 1.8.9 that's the one people use for combat and stuff but most people are here because they want the latest release 1.16 and you just click download now it's going to send you this page do not click anything on this page do not hit this fake download link wait for this countdown and then you skip the ad okay do not click anything on here other than skip and then it'll take you to this download, and then you download it. There's an ad, of course. Don't click on it. And it downloads. Oh. And then it'll redirect you to another ad, which don't click on. Just exit out. And just let Oplifine download. It should download and work as long as you do have the latest version of Java. This is why I cannot stress enough. So, yep, you just got to make sure you let it download. It's going to say this. Uh, it may be harmful. You keep. It's not harmful. And you open it. It's opening. It's opening. And you got to make sure you are on the latest version. And it's open. And then it will bring you to here. And then it wants you to install. And you click install. And boom. Opifine is successfully installed. Now for she And let me just open up. Hello, editing tool. Hello, OBS. Open up Minecraft for you. It's going to take a second. There it goes. And most of the time you got to go to installations, new. Then it says, then there should be your offline. Click create. And then play. It's going to install and then it should boot straight up. Whenever it does. <laughs> It will only just take a second. But my computer is running a little bit slow right now because I am using OBS. 
and <laughs> my editing tool in the background. Ooh. Okay. Let me just tab out there. Okay, never mind. It will load faster for you. I'm just having slow signal with my internet right now. Amplifying isn't really a based off Wi-Fi, but sometimes it just runs faster. And it'll say modded, but it's really not. And you can go on Hypixel and stuff like that without being banned. You can also get on your friend's servers. My friend Gabe's on Matondo server. Just quit the game for now. So what you need to do is click install. And it'll bring you to the page full of which one. Like, it'll tell you, tell you how to do it. I mean, you gotta go click downloads. And then this will have all the ones that you may want. I use, the, the first one I showed you, the Enchanted Default. That's the one I personally use when I'm bored. And then this is like using Mojang and shit like that. I don't know. I never really use this. So I'm just... Now these ones are like for the lighting... The extreme volume lighting and stuff. And this I'm just going to download one real quick. Uh, medium. Since I don't have the medium one. Again. Do not click anything on this page. Do not click that. Just wait for the countdown. And you skip. And then it will bring you straight to the media fire page. Where you can just click download. And then boom. Is that a real Mr. Beast ad? Or is this like a fucking fake one? So now I would recommend you just going to your search bar, get percent app data, and then you open that folder up. And then you want to go to your dot Minecraft folder, and then you want to find the one that says shader packs right here. And then, oop, oh, and then you just drag it in there. And as you can see, I do have some shaders installed. And now I just need to open up Minecraft. Now that you're in Minecraft, just go to just go to a random world. Or you can do this when you're already on the server. If you're planned servers. Or if you just want like a single player experience. Oh. So you want to go to uh, like you want to want to click your escape, click options, video settings, and then shaders. And then here's all your shader packs. This is the one I've. This is the one we just downloaded. The medium, and yeah, there's really not a difference other than with like the whole lighting stuff. But yeah, so that's how you install shaders, and Oplifine. As you can see, like I'm my computer is chugging. You probably can hear the fan. Let me let me see. Let oop. let's see what it looks like at night. Yeah, <laughs> that just looks really nice though. But yeah. So that's how you install shaders. Thank you guys for actually taking the time to watch this tutorial. Tutorial. The YouTube tutorial. <laughs> Make sure to subscribe. Hit the like button if it helped. If it didn't, oh well. Subscribe. Hit the bell. Thank you guys for watching. Love you all.